Alright, so doing an unboxing of uh, a, well I finally got this in the mail. I was pretty fast getting this in the mail. Um, well, what this is, is it's my, uh, well I'm pretty sure it's my Alpha Wireless Network card that I can use for penetration testing for networks, wireless networks and all. Uh, so we'll go ahead and open this thing up. Surprisingly, that it didn't take that long to get here, even though I ordered it on Friday. And it is, I believe, Wednesday now. That's not too bad. That's not too bad on shipping. Alright, so it came in a little wrapping. Excuse me, I'll send this little thing again. Paperwork. Yeah, it looks like it's paperwork in here. eBay paperwork and all that. Bought it for, uh, I don't know if you see that or not, but, uh, bought it, whoops, it's over here, there we go. Bought it for $27, came out the 20, yep, came out to $28 and some change. Not bad for the original price that it was. Alright, let's open this thing up. And here it is, the awful wireless network card. There you go. The Alpha Wireless Network card. I don't know y'all can see that or not. I got a pretty good deal on this, I believe. I mean, you know, the original price was uh, like, uh, I think it was like 28 bucks. 20 bucks is what it was for. I think it was like 28 bucks or something like that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was like 28 bucks, but I got him to take like a dollar, like, I think it was like a $20.50 or something like that. You got him to take a, a dollar and 50 cents off of it, so that's not too bad. I saved a dollar and 50 cents. Yeah, better than paying full price for it, I guess. Let's see if I can get this open or not. Fortunately, I didn't bring a knife with me yet again in this video. That I always do. I end up using toenail clippers, but this time I got them to use a flathead screwdriver <laughs> to peel this sticker off of this box here. And just a side note that the uh, flathead screwdriver does not work great for opening a box that's sealed. So, uh, Yeah. And chewing your nails is not a good idea either if you want to open stuff up. Well, it sure made this so it won't get stolen, so uh, I got a smaller screwdriver that I'm going to try and get this box open with. Possibly fast forward through this video a couple of minutes, maybe. I don't know how long it'll take me to get this box open. <laughs> All right, here we go. I finally got the tape to unseal. A little, little store screwdriver works real, real well. Looks like. All right, so peel the tape off of this. All right, tape peel off of this. A little bit peel off, not by much. Alright, here we go. Final box is open. Alright, so as you can see, there's some goodies in there. We got some. We got the wireless card there. That's the wireless card where my finger is. And this is some, uh, some pieces that you can use, little accessories. We got the USB cable. Got the antenna that goes on the uh, wireless card. Um, got a clip and a mount. Uh, let's see, you got a little disc. It comes with a little disc. I don't know if you can see that or not, but there's a little disc in there. And there's the card. This is the wireless card. It's an ugly little thing. It's a big, ugly little, uh, <laughs> ugly little uh, wireless card, but uh, it works extremely well for penetration testing. These little uh, these little uh, alpha 
powerful wireless card. This one looks kind of big, but it's actually smaller than it looks online. It's actually a lot smaller than it looks online, surprisingly. This thing is only about that big. About like that big with my fingers, so that's pretty small. Surprisingly, it looks bigger online. And, uh, yeah, so, yeah, I'm going to be using this for um, cracking wireless networks. A lot of people are still using WEP, and if you're still using WEP, Dang, man, you better stop using that fast because your your neighbor's probably already broke into your wife by an hour. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching. This has been Matthew. And uh, I also run a website called Zarbyte.com, which is a security related website. It changes so much, though. It, it can be, the design changes a lot because I'm never happy with the site and with the way it looks and all that. You can check out the site if you want. It be in the description. I also have another YouTube channel on here um, for uh, fiber optics. That's uh, P H I B E R O T I C S. So if you want to check that out, you can check it out on YouTube as well. See you later.